Hey and welcome back to the channel today we will be exploring the golden circle. The first place we are visiting is Thingvellir National Park. Thingvellir National Park, located in southwestern Iceland, is a site of both historical and geological significance. Established in 1930, it is the location of the Althing, one of the world's oldest parliaments, founded in 930 AD. The park sits on the boundary between the North American and Eurasian tectonic plates, making it a geological wonder with visible rift valleys and fissures. Thingvellir is also part of the Golden Circle. Now we explore Gulfus Waterfall it was extremely windy there as it's winter also we couldn't go to the lower deck due to extreme slippiness. Gulfos, meaning Golden Falls, in Icelandic, is a stunning waterfall located in the canyon of the Hvida River in southwest Iceland. This natural wonder is renowned for its dramatic two-stage cascade, the upper drop plunges 11 meters, 36 feet, while the lower drop descends another 21 meters, 69 feet, creating a powerful and mesmerizing spectacle. The waterfall's name is inspired by the golden hue that often appears in its waters, especially under sunlight. Gullfoss is a key feature of Iceland's famed Golden Circle tourist route, attracting visitors with its raw beauty and the surrounding rugged landscape. Its significance is not only natural but also historical, as it was at the center of early 20th century conservation efforts, notably championed by Sigra Thomas Dotter, whose activism helped to protect it from potential exploitation. Geyser, located in the Hockadalar Valley of Iceland, is one of the world's most famous geysers and the origin of the word geyser. This geothermal feature has been active for approximately 10,000 years, erupting scalding hot water up to 70 meters, 230 feet, into the air. Though its activity has fluctuated over the years, with periods of dormancy and revival often triggered by earthquakes, geyser remains a popular attraction within the Golden Circle tourist route. Nearby, the Strocker geyser provides more frequent eruptions, every 5 to 10 minutes, adding to the geothermal spectacle of the area. The region's geothermal activity is a result of Iceland's location on the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, where the Eurasian and North American tectonic plates meet. Now we visit Carid Crater, we arrive in the slippery winter. Carid Crater, located in South Iceland's Grimsons area, is a striking volcanic crater lake formed about 3,000 years ago. Unlike many other volcanic craters, which are typically formed by explosive eruptions, Carid is believed to have been created when a cone volcano erupted and then emptied its magma reserve, causing the remaining structure to collapse into the empty magma chamber. <laughs> 